Let's learn about go to keyword in C programming language, which we do not recommend you to use, but just know how it works. Okay. So I'll take an integer variable count and initialize it to a value of one. Now I'll iterate through the while loop until count is less than or equal to 10. When this count value is five, I'll write the keyword go to and a label that is five, write anything which is not a keyword by the way. So five is called label here. So after this if statement, I'll simply output the output something I'll output IBM. I'll even number it so that you can know how many times this while loop got iterated. Okay. So once count value is five and the control executes go to five, it searches the program for label five. Once it finds that label, whatever statement is present for five, that is label five gets executed. In this case, this is fifth loop gets executed. Okay. You can even bring this down like this. Both works the same way. So let me compile and run this program. So the for loop executes for one, two, three and four times. Once count is five, go to five is encountered and the control searches for the label five and this is fifth loop statement gets executed. So this is how go to statement works. Please as far as possible, avoid using this go to statements. Instead, we can write the same program using our while for do while continue break statements. Okay. So nonetheless, know how go to statements work in C programming language. Please visit the link present in the description section of this YouTube video for source code notes and discussion about this topic. Please stay subscribed to our YouTube channel and blog. Share this video with your friends online and please do not forget to like this video on YouTube. Thank you.